How Rich People Think by Steve Siebold, book summary. Introduction. Did you ever think about what stops you to become rich? The answer is your thinking. This book isn't about money or wealth, it's about our thinking. And how our thinking can change our financial life and the changes that will begin in your life. The author interview rich people because he wants to be rich. Then he realized there is a big difference between poor and rich people thinking. This book mainly compares about middle class and world class. How they have a different perception of the world. How they have a different belief about money and wealth. How thinking like world class will make you world class. This book differentiates average people and world class people and how they differ in thinking. 1. Middle class focus on savings. World class focus on earnings. Middle class people focus to save money and how to protect money because they make a decision based on fear of loss and unpredictability of the future. But the world class thinkers understand the exact opposite way they know the importance of saving and investing. They earn a large sum of money by serving people and creating solutions to problems that worth solving. They focus on accumulating wealth. When economic correction occurs, the middle class sell short term for survival while world class buy assets for long term financial success. Middle class make a decision based on fear, and world class make decision based on abundance. World class people aren't afraid to take calculated risks, because even if they lose all, they can get that back. The world class people invest there wisely and they manage money well. World class people focus on the thing which will make them more money. If you're already rich then keep focusing on the same way you did past, if you're not rich, then it's the right time to change. World class people know they can accumulate more wealth by the service they provide to people. The middle class focus on the lottery and frugal life and missing the big opportunities and world class people on another side focus on opportunities. It's the right time to question yourself. Are you focus on pennies or big wealth? Are you trying to save money or earn money? Did you focus on opportunities? Did you make decision based on fear? Are you taking any calculated risks? Did you invest your money wisely? 2. Middle class thinks about money in linear terms. World class thinks about money in nonlinear terms. Middle class people trade their time for money. They have a belief that making money is a linear process, time and money is connected. Middle class people think the only way to earn a large sum of money is by working a lot and a lot of hours. Without expecting raises and bonuses. The world class know, to be wealthy you need to think in nonlinear terms. The people who generate a big sum of money, know they need to serve people and give solutions to problems. World class know how to earn money through ideas that solve problems. The middle class struggle to survive and scared for their financial future, while the world class understand there is no limit to ideas so there is no limit to how much we can earn. The middle class waste their mental energy to focus on worrying about money. Fortunes can be created almost overnight with the right idea at the right time, but only if the performer understands this non-linear phenomenon. The people who think they can earn money by linear terms, never educate themselves on what it takes to become wealthy. The middle class never invest efforts to create high-impact solutions. The average middle class people refuse to believe the nonlinear terms, but the who get richer know about nonlinear terms, this is one of the reasons why the rich get richer and the poor get poorer. 3. Middle class believes hard work creates wealth. World class believes leverage creates wealth. If you think hard work will make you rich, then first you have to change your mind. If hard work makes you rich then most people on earth would be rich. Every construction workers, bartender, cleaners, are work hard so then they get rich, right? No, in secret to get rich is where to put hard work is important than hard work. World class work hard but not in the traditional way, they put all their efforts into the profitable side of the business. The middle class think hard work is the route to success, but the world class know hard work means, working together of collective brain of best advisor, thinking outside the box. World class give more importance to success than anything else. They understood the success is what makes them honorable. The middle class work off physically and mentally for others, and exhausted at end of the day, while world class understood importance make them working for themselves. World class work for ideas and solutions to problems, as a result, middle class people living paycheck to paycheck while the world class life without limits. Right now, anyone in this world in the middle class can change their thinking and earn a large sum of money, but they don't because they're unaware of thinking different and they don't believe themselves. The middle class don't believe it's possible to be wealthy with an idea and just by changing their mentality a little they can earn fortunes. That's why the middle class stay poor and worrying about monthly bills while the world class continue to earn a fortune and enjoy their life. 4. Middle class believes money is the, the root of all evil. World class believes poverty is the root of all evil. The middle class has been manipulated to believe that rich people are bad people. They have been brainwashed that rich people are dishonest, 
They're lucky enough. As a result, middle class people only focus on limitations and no idea about what it is meant to be wealthy, and they think money will bring you unhappiness, but the world class know money doesn't buy you happiness, but money gives you freedom. Freedom to do whatever you want to do, buy things which you want. More money makes your life easy and more enjoyable. It is not rich or education or intelligence or any talent that holding back the middle class from not getting rich, it is their own belief, that what holds them back from not getting rich and struggle to survive daily in the world of wealth. While world class build their belief system about money and its advantages. If you're poor and want to be wealthy, just follow the belief of people who are already wealthy, if you want something to follow the people who have what you want. Our actions based on our beliefs, if you think money is bad, then you'll take action, around the belief, but when you change yourself and your belief about money, you'll be rich. The middle class people work and search for answers on the outside, the world class people work and search for answers from inside. 5. Middle class believes being rich is a privilege. World class believes being rich is a right. The middle class people think only lucky people get rich not everyone. But the world class know the truth, everyone in the world can be rich and if they want if they provide value or solution to problems. The middle class think you can get rich by lottery tickets or any inherent. In simple words, the middle class want lottery tickets to get rich and the world class do work to get rich. When the middle class buy the lottery ticket, pray for the right number and wait on TV to get selected, the world class work on ideas and create value for other people. If you want to get rich then you have to give value to people if you make their life better and easier and simpler you have the right to be rich this is what world class people believe. The middle class give more importance to entertainment than to be rich, they watch TV, wasting time on social media, while the world class people work on their dreams to get rich. Most people stay poor, not because they don't love to be rich, but they believe being rich is not possible for them. Becoming rich is far more away from middle class people mentality. But in a world class mentality, Anyone in the world who lives in society can be rich if they provide value. The world class always create new ways to build wealth, they always look for ideas, solutions. They build their values, skills, they work on ideas. You have all the rights to be rich. 6. Middle class believes money is complicated. World class believes money is simple. For the middle class people making money is mysterious, for the world class people, cash flow from ideas. The world class know the more value you create in your marketplace the richer you become. The world class people easily convert things from complex to simple, that anyone can follow again and again, it's simple, getting rich is simple, the big problem you solve, the richer you can become, the bigger the solution, the bigger paycheck. Middle class people think rich people are lucky, smart, and more educated but this isn't true. The world class people focus only on endless opportunities, and they see opportunities over obstacles. No matter how many times the world class people fail they persist until they succeed. The world class people don't have a lack and limitation mentality. The middle class don't believe their possibilities to get rich, then they stop the dream, settling for less, enjoy their little. On the other side, world class people believe in themselves to get rich. They don't stop trying until they succeed, they don't stop dreaming even after multiple failures, and lastly, they succeed, then enjoy their life a lot. There is no mystery to get rich. Money is simple, your belief will make you rich or poor. 7. Middle class believes rich people are crooks. The world class believes rich people are ambitious. We often, taught in childhood, by parents, teachers, friends, neighbors, coaches and a lot of people, they taught us rich people are bad. They get rich, by doing bad things, through dishonesty, deceit. This is the best reason people give you when you ask them why they are financially poor. But the world class people know you can earn a large sum of money only through, ambition and vision and determination. The middle class people criticize rich people to justice themselves. Their belief grew stronger about the rich, and that is passed to a future generation, so this makes their future generations unaware of wealth. As a result, they stay poor for a long generation. World class people take full responsibility for their life and results and focus their mental energy toward the only goal to be rich. They use their brain to be creative and create a solution for problems. While middle class people trying hard to find a way to criticize as rich people while world class people work hard at their ideas. The middle class people use blame and excuses, for everything happening in their life, while the world class people taking action and getting results. Self-made rich people get rich with self-confidence and knowing what they want, in life. Believing in yourself and your abilities won't make you rich, but it will drive you to take the actions that will. Never criticizes rich people instead admire them. 8. Middle class believes building wealth is a solitary effort. The world class believes building wealth is a team effort. 
The middle class paid money for their time and effort by a firm. This limits their worth to firms. But the world class people know it takes a team to build wealth and ideas and solutions to problems. They focus more of their mental energy on finding the right people for working together and to leverage their actions and ideas. The greatest fortunes are built through the collective mental and physical contributions the world class people work as a leader with employees, partners, friends, contractors. Middle class people wants to take personal credits for everything achieved. While the world class people happily give credits to team members for the results they achieve. The middle class people comfort more than anything else. While world class people satisfied with being rich. One of the big differences between world class and middle class is world class build a great team and share the credit. The middle class people even though they don't make much money they crave recognition and their ego based more than result oriented. But the world class people are satisfied to give credit to teams for exchange of profits. 9. Middle class worries about money. World class dreams about money. The middle class person spends a lot of time worrying about a lack of money. We were manipulated since childhood about money which makes to repeat the words I don't care about money. Money is not important things. Our parents repeatedly teach us about how more money leads to bad. This makes us worrying about money instead of dreaming. Middle class people spend most of their life worrying about a lack of money instead of how can earn money. But the world class people give full efforts towards ideas that will make them more money. The middle class people see money with fear and scarcity mentality. Hold the world class people see money with love and abundance. The world class see possibilities of opportunity with money. The world class people don't see money with fear. As a result, they achieve their financial success and endless confidence. Higher intelligence and higher intelligence are not the secrets to success. The real secret to success is having belief like world class people. The world class dream about how to acquire money, how to move towards goals and opportunities, good things that can happen with money. And lastly they acquire money. 10. Middle class believes money is negative. World class believes money is positive. Middle class people see rich and ambitious people as greedy and negative and bad people. This is the reason why the middle class can't be wealthy. Middle class people want money, but they never focus on money and they never give their mental energies to money. For middle class people money is a negative thing. It is the source of all problems, the root of evil. They want but they don't give effort. But for the world class Money is a positive thing. It is the solution for all problems. Lack of money is the root of evil. They want and they give effort. And for the world class, money is a tool for freedom. With freedom you can do whatever you want to do, buy things you desire and opportunity. Of course, you will get more opportunities by being rich than by being poor. The world class see money as a tool for option. You will get option if you have money to live what you want. Money will give you freedom. With freedom You can do what you want when you want as long as you want with whom you want without limits. Most millionaires give their money to donation. They ran charities. They give money to charities. Without money charities can't run, but the middle class criticize them for being selfish and greedy. They even pay more tax than the middle class pay in their whole lifetime. The belief you adopt will lead you to abundant wealth or middle class mediocrity. 11. Middle class believes rich people are shallow. World class believes rich people are strategic. The middle class believes being poor is honorary. And people believe those who are poor are innocent and good people. The traditions that manipulate us to be poor teach us being poor are holy, and even religions teaches even you don't have money to pay rent, but you have to give money to charity. The people who say God is nothing in front of money by the name of God are the ones who are living in a mansion and flying in their private jets. The rich people strategic and straightforward towards their goals. They openly show their desire to build a better financial life. The world class directly work to build a better financial life and they honest to their goals. The world class people goals are simple they aim to get rich. They work discipline and have manners towards their works. This makes them ultra wealthy. Their strategies will help them to reach their goals quickly. The world class know they can get rich by serving others. While the middle class see rich people as materialistic and scold them while they have a big debt and uncertainty about the future. The world class people completely ignore the criticisms and move towards their financial independence and superior wealth. 12. Middle class believes the road to riches is paved with formal education. World class believes the road to riches is paved with specific knowledge. The world class people give respect to formal education and importance but not more than their specific knowledge on a field. The world class have little or no formal education but they have a lot of specific knowledge on the field. They acquired financial success and better life through specific knowledge. Formal education teaches us to trade time for money and think and perform in a linear mindset. You have little or no chance of becoming wealthy by trading time for money. 
but the world class people understand the non linear mindset, they acquire skills by own, they have a lot of creative skills, they constantly grow themselves by learning new things. They don't focus on limitation and lack. The rich use their brain and others' brain to focus on problem solving and getting rich with that. While the poor believe getting a degree will only make them rich. You don't need a doctorate and master degrees to get rich, you just need a little common sense. The world class people work their brain to make complex problems simpler, while the middle class work their brain to make simple problems complex. Focusing on simple thing will make you rich, now or later, and then the middle class will name it luck. 13. Middle class believes money is earned through labor. World class believes money is earned through thought. In this world, most people can't become wealthy because they think in a linear mindset. The harder and longer they work, the rich they can become. You can't become wealthy by thinking in a linear mindset. The middle class follow the old model for success. In this world, the world class people know you can learn more if you have the creative skills that many people lack. The most valuable asset is creative thinking, while the middle class thinking about good school and college for their children. Many people taught us that if we good grades in school and college, we can succeed guaranteed. We can rarely achieve anything by following. This model very few world class people followed this. The world class people train their brains to find solutions for the problems that worth solving. Anyone in this can do this if they train their mind to focus on solutions for problems, then take the action for your thoughts. The world class people know you can get rich through thoughts, creativity, problem solving mindset, but not thorough labor. While the middle class people believe you can get rich by doing labor and working hard and long. 14. Middle class worries about running out of money. World class thinks about how to make more money. In reality, middle class people spend more time than world class people thinking about money, but instead of dreaming or thinking about making more, they worry and think about what happens if run out of money. They waste their energy by focusing on what happens if we run out of money, what happens if they lose their jobs. The middle class spend a lot of time only focusing on negative about money and bad luck about money. Their thinking destructs their action towards money. Their mindset about money is negative and bad that impacts their financial life. They are surviving instead of living. They have a fear-based mindset. The world class people try to find solutions to problems that will be profitable. They know money will follow the ideas and solutions, so they directly focus on problems that worth solving and they build a creative mindset, which is in high demand and low supply. Every product or service that has made our lives better has come from creative thought. When world class wants to make money, they work on solutions with creativity. Those who criticize the rich for being obsessed with money are the ones who work more time than world class for money. Money flows to great ideas like water if the middle class people use their mental power and their energy toward solution, they can also be rich. 15. Middle class thinks about spending. World class thinks about investing. Middle class people are known for living beyond their means, which means they spend more than they make just to impress people. They buy things in debt. They don't have any discipline towards their money. They are good at managing money badly. They even criticized by many financial advisors for their money management things. And some middle class people save money, but that is not so good. Saving money is good, not great, is because you're losing your money. Inflation eating your money, your money purchasing power decrease day by day. To stop this you have to invest money. You have to invest in money assets that return rate has to surpass the inflation rate. You can invest in stocks, bonds, real estate, painting and any other that value has to appreciate in future the reason the rich get richer is they invest the money in assets instead of spending and saving the world class people know money is a great worker more than anyone because money will work for them 24 hours a day 7 days a week all days in a month and every day in the year the more they invest the more their money work for them the bigger problems you solve the wealthier society will make you the world class know the more people benefits from your ideas and solutions the more money you can make If you have a penny try to learn how to invest not to spend or save. 16. Middle class sees money through the eyes of emotion. World class sees money through the eyes of logic. You can't acquire great wealth by having a middle class mindset or a limited mindset and fear mentality and surrounded by negative emotions. You're brainwashed by a lot of people who surround yourself because they have a middle class mindset. They teach wrong about money to you because they also learned wrongly about money. We repeatedly taught a middle class mindset by our elders. until we repeat it to others we hear only negative things about money over and over again since we are born and then they begin our own beliefs a middle class thinker can't teach you how to become a world class thinker if you see things through logic you gain an advantage you stop listening to advice to get rich from poor people it makes sense right 
Only a few people can see positive about money over surrounding negative about money. World class people see money through logical thinking, they know where money is useful and where money is useless. And world class know they can get options and opportunities for money. When it comes to money, don't see through emotions like fear, greed, see through logic, understand. 17. Middle class underestimates the, the wealth building power of referral marketing. The world class knows referral marketing creates millionaires. The world class understood the power of referral marketing. They earn large sums of money through this, while the middle class people still criticizing referral marketing. Referral marketing includes network effect, multi level marketing, direct sales, event or party marketing, affiliate program, and others. You don't need a lot of qualifications to start referral marketing. There is a lot of millionaires and billionaires who use this correctly, even though they don't have a great degree. The author analyzes the world wealthiest people and learned referral marketers are the tough business person in the world. Most of them start with little or no money, while still working or studying. Network marketing has proven itself to be a viable and rewarding source of income. There have been some remarkable examples of success Donald Trump. Referral marketing is the best chance for the average person to start a business for a few hundred dollars that have the potential to make them a millionaire, and more people are seeing that every day. 18. Middle class focuses on pleasurable activities. World class focus on money making activities. Middle class people spend more time just entertaining themselves. They give more importance to find a way to entertain themselves, more than finds ways to make money. They want a comfort zone more than success, they want pleasure more than anything in this world, for middle class people effort is an unimportant thing than pleasure. The world class people focus on money making activities, they give effort, they give most of their attention to these things. We can also get rich overnight by giving what the middle class people want most comfort and entertainment. The world class people make money while enjoying doing their hobbies, they try to make money by doing what they love to do. The world class focus on profit producing products, while the middle class focus on football goals, cricket scores. The middle class think rich people work all time, but that is not what happens. The world class people, doing what they love, try to get paid for it. Even author interviewed the world wealthiest people for 26 years. The things he learned from the wealthy people are people can make more and more money if they do what they love to do. 19. Middle class sees money as a finite resource. The world class sees money as an infinite resource. The average middle class people have the mentality that money is limited, not everyone in this world gets rich, they have to struggle and work hard for their money before anyone else gets it. They have a shortage mentality, they believe it is very harder to make money and very, very harder to keep it. The reason they stay poor is because of their mentality, negative and short perception towards money. As a result, they end up with little or no net worth. Again, the world class people are the exact opposite. They don't have a negative or shortage mentality. They have a positive perception of money and wealth. As a result, they end up in high net worth, an average middle class can't even imagine. The rich understand money flows from ideas, and since ideas are limitless, money is limitless. The middle class people try to catch as much money as possible, while the world class creating new ideas and solutions and earn large sums of money. The rich are caring, passionate people, they know how to manage their money, how to use correctly to advance their life. The rich mindset is entirely different from the poor, if they want more money, they work within their brain and create an abundance of wealth, they know they can generate wealth through infinite resources, while the poor think there are only a few ways to earn money. 20. Middle class earns money doing things they don't like to do. World class gets rich doing what they love. The average middle class person wants a job that pays them a lot. They can stick with a job for years and think about retirement. They change the jobs, they change the posting, they change the companies, but they never try to change their mentality. Many people are in jobs they don't like, but they still work for a paycheck, and they continuously worrying about fired from the job. They want jobs not because don't have enough talent to start a new company. But they want a job for money to pay the bills, they continuously brainwash to work in a frim, since childhood, starting from schools to colleges to parents to friends to society, everyone manipulates them to work, and they linear in shortage mindset. On the other side, the rich get rich by following their passion, they have a non linear mindset. Do what you love and the money will follow. Only a small number of people understood this and they take action on this. If you adopt this type of mentality, no one can stop you from being rich. On the opposite side, For years, poor people adopt fear and limitation and shortage mentality. This will make you stop entering rich people clubs. The first world class belief about the wealth you must adopt is that it's possible to do what you love and get rich doing it. Try to adopt this type of mentality, it will make anything possible for you. 
21. Middle class believes rich people are ruthless. The world class believes rich people are generous. Many poor people believe world class people are rich because they are materialistic and greedy. Many middle class people believe they are poor because the rich selfish, they take over all the money, but in reality, everyone in this world can be rich if they take action towards it, and if they change their mentality, and change perceptions towards money and wealthy people. Most of the poor think the world class people are ruthless, they can do anything for money, but in reality, lack of money is the root of evil. People criticize the rich for reap tax benefits and using political favors, the majority of rich people give because they can. Yes, money not only gives freedom to live but also gives enormous power to live the way you want to live. While the people criticizing achievers, even governments and society can't run, if the rich didn't exist, they pay more tax than poor pay in a whole lifetime. And they build things, they create ideas, they create solutions, they create products, they create services, we can't build a better lifestyle without rich people. While the poor criticize the rich, the world-class people admire other rich people, because they know they can't be someone that they hate, the world-class people treat other rich people with respect and dignity, it will make them rich in future. The poor scolds the rich and can't be wealthy on the other side the rich mindset people admire other rich people and will become one of the rich people. 22. Middle class has a lottery mentality. World class has an action mentality. Middle class people believe winning the lottery ticket is the only to get rich or earn a large sum of money. They believe in the lottery because they don't believe in their abilities, they don't believe in their skills, they don't believe in their talent, they don't believe in their faith, they don't believe in their ideas, but they believe a lot in luck. Their belief about money is shortage and limit and linear, as a result, they can't be wealthy in their financial life. The few middle class people will get rich if they only broke the laws that forced on them, since childhood, lucky people only get rich. On the opposite side, the rich know, everyone in this world can be if they take action towards it. Their belief about money, lead them to take action and focus on what matters, they know, the one that prepares themselves for opportunities are lucky people. They take action to get rich little by little. While the middle class talk about getting rich, the world class people take action to get rich, they work on their ideas, they work on their solutions. Even the middle class desire to be rich, but their belief system stop them from taking necessary steps. Beliefs dictate behavior, and behavior dictates results. If you want to get rich, then take action, if you want to change action, then change your mentality to world class, even though you aren't rich in reality, but the mindset you have leads you to be rich. The rich peoples are not smarter than us. They know it takes action to win in life and financial. 23. Middle class is waiting to be rescued from financial mediocrity. World class knows no one is coming to the rescue. The middle class people believe, the political leaders, sportsmen, celebrities, even gods will help them to get rich. Most people in this world have a mentality, outside force or someone who will rescue them from their station and make them get rich in their life. They wait for angels to come down to them, fulfill what they desire. They wait for the government to help them. The greatest risk you can take is playing it safe while expecting to get what you want. But the world-class people know, no one coming to us fulfills our desire. They know no come to us, to rescue for our situations, or help us to get rich in life. They know, they can only change their lives. They know, they can only make them rich. The wealthiest people are the happiest people not because they're rich, but because, they made themselves, they set goals, they surpass their goals, they make themselves wealthy, they believe in themselves, they don't wait for others to help them, they don't wait for governments, they don't wait for God. They know money can't buy them happiness, but money will give opportunities, they make their life better, money makes their life easier, money makes their life comfortable, money will give them opportunities to experience things that most people can even imagine. Remember, no one will come to help you or rescuing from the situation. To become rich or to become poor, it's all in your hands. 24. Middle class people believe rich people are smarter. World class people believe rich people are savvy. The human brain is far more complex than any written test can measure. To test human intelligence we conduct, IQ tests in schools, these test measures show a human memorizing capacity and recall information. Intelligence comes from emotional, logical, skills and talents that are hard to measure. Some people are good at memorizing so they're best in school, college, some are good at physical so they're best in sports. While some people are good at spiritual, so they're best in relationships. And some people are good at money managing so they're best in society. Few people born with this skill, while most people learn from their role models, from their inspiration, they adopt the mindset of rich people, they adopt rich people beliefs, they adopt rich people philosophies, they adopt rich people behaviors. Everyone is smart in some way. 
The secret to getting rich is getting inside the minds of people who are already rich and finding out how and what they think and believe about money. If you want to be a billionaire, don't ever take advice from a beggar, the same way, millionaires can only teach you how to become a millionaire. If smart people only get rich, then people who get good grades will only get rich. Aware about saving and investing money will make a big impact on your financial life than anything else. 25. Middle class sees money as controlling. World class sees money as liberating. The middle class people believe, money will control us, it controls what we can and what we can't. The poor believe money is master and we have to be a slave. The middle class has the mindset money is control everything and we have to surrender to money, it's because they have a shortage and limit mentality. But the world class people think different, they believe money gives opportunities and freedom, to do whatever they want to do, how long they want to do, and it gives options and better life. The rich believe money is a slave, and we can be master of it. The rich are the people who escape their mentality to rich from a middle class, they know money is a tool for freedom, not to feel, fear or worry about. The rich get rich by doing what they want, and they don't do what they don't want, they try to make money while doing what they love to do. The rich have become rich by thinking differently than most of us were taught, and their actions are the effect of this cause remember money gives you more freedom and power than anything else in this world. While middle class people think it controls people, let's get freedom. 26. Middle class believes money changes people. The world class believes money reveals people. The middle class has a mindset, money turns people into bad, corrupt, greedy, dictators, but in reality, money never changed people it reveals them. This is a great reason poor people tell why they are not rich. Money will only make people more of what they already are. If you're a kind person, more money will make you kinder, if you're an honest person, more money will make you more honest, if you're a humble person, more money will more humble. If you're a bad person, more money will make a very bad person. If you're a corrupt person, more money will make you a more corrupt person. If you're a greedy person, more money will make you more greedy. If you're a cheating person, more money will make you more cheating person. The middle class love to blame money as their problem, instead of taking responsibility for their lives, people love to blame money as their problem for everything. The rich continue getting richer, being who they always were. Money will make you more of what you already are. If you're not a nice person, money's going to make you a despicable individual. If you're a good person, money's going to make you a better person. Bob Proctor 27. Middle class believes in working for money. The world class believes in working for fulfillment. The middle class people manipulated for years to work for a job for decades just to a retiree with nothing, the whole advice is bad, they taught us to spend most of our life spent on occupation, which we don't like, just for money, lastly, retire as a broke. The great ones go through an extensive introspective soul-searching process to discover what they love to do and combine it with their unique talents and abilities. When you're doing something you love to do, the only reward you need is the experience of doing it. Bill Gope instead of trying to work on a job that gives you a good paycheck, try to work on a job that gives you fulfillment. The greatest reward for working on a job is doing what you love, and getting high fulfillment from that. Invest so much heart and soul into your work that you become one of the most competent people in your field. You'll be rewarded with uncommon wealth. The middle class works on fear and scarcity mentality, the world class works on love and abundance, this simple difference between people, one group leads their life to survival and another group to enjoy their life. A man is a success if he gets up in the morning and gets to bed at night and in between does what he wants to do. Bob Dylan 28. Middle class believes you have to do something to get rich. World class believes you have to be something to get rich. Only a few people know to think beyond labor to create a fortune, and most of them think labor is the only way to get rich. The poor people see rich people as talents, skills, and luck to become rich. The rich have something in themselves that the poor be can't even imagine. The world class have a mindset, they have to be rich, fulfilled and happy in life. Because they know everyone in this world can be rich, they know they have the right to become rich, they have the right to be happy, no matter how many times they fail in their lives, they know, they have the right to win in life. The middle class people give the effort and expect immediate results for their efforts, they have an instant gratification mindset. While the world class give the effort and patiently wait for the results, the rich have a delayed gratification mindset. The rich learn from every experience they face, whether it's success or failure. Their secret is to focus on being the person capable of getting the results they desire this makes a person control everything around things, he doesn't have to depend on luck or market conditions, he can't be controlled by outside forces. 29. Middle class plays it safe with money. World class takes calculated risks. 
the middle class people make a decision based on fear and scarcity mentality, which makes them even poorer than before. But on the other side, the rich know money as employees they make their money work for them, their money work for them 24 hours a day. They attract more money to their financial life. The middle class has a fear around, they fear to invest their money, their fear makes them think what if I lose all money? Returns and risks are connected. You will lose money along the way. Every investor loses money sometimes, but they know they can earn more in future. The rich know they have to take calculated risks to win in life. They know the more they have experienced, the more they can earn. The middle class people want security, they want to play it safe, while the world class people ready to take calculated risks, want to play it offensively. The middle class group is worried about losing all the money they invest, while the world class group dream about possibilities to earn more by investing and creating ideas. Middle class people worrying about quitting jobs, work as slaves to jobs and think about celebrating weekends. By not taking any risks, they can't enjoy freedom. While the world class people work on their ideas and solutions, they employees people on their ideas, they take calculated risks, as a result, they get large returns. 30. Middle class believes you have to have money to make money. The world class believes in using other people's money. The majority of people on earth has a linear mindset. A linear mindset tells them, the more they work the more they can earn. They'll make more money if they work hard enough, but in reality, it is the reason why most people don't get rich, and it's the ineffective way to make more money. But the world class has, again, a non-linear mindset, they relate mindset to money. For example, entrepreneurs are creating ideas, if they're unable to fund their ideas, they let investors invest in their ideas. World class people always look for greater opportunities to invest. While, the middle class still money will make more money, but you can make from ideas and solutions. Money is only an instrument of exchange. Creative ideas are a scarce resource, but most people are so focused on where the money is coming from, that they ignore their ideas, yet the ideas are the only thing that will attract the money. If world-class people want to start a business, if they don't have enough money, they get debt from banks to start their business, because they know it's easier to borrow $10 million than $10,000. Use other people money to make money. 31. Middle-class believes jobs are the safest way to earn money. The world class believes outstanding performance is the safest way to earn money. Again and again, we're manipulated since childhood, get good grades in school, get good grades in college, then get jobs that will pay a good paycheck. For middle class people, the job is the safest path to earning money, while it's slowest, not safest. The world class people don't work for a paycheck, they know they will get paid for their values, not for their time. The truth is, having a job is no safer than owning a business. The world-class people work for themselves, so they can in future, they don't get yelled at by their boss. They can choose which hours they can work, they can choose how many hours to work, they can even change the path of the business, at any time they wish. In simple words, they're self-employed. They create their job and they work towards their destiny. The middle class believe the job is the only to earn money and safest, while the world class knows the only safety any service or product provider has lies in her ability to perform how much you earn it's based on, the service or product you deliver, how many people are satisfied with it. Very few people get rich by job, the rich know they have to invade the opportunities to become rich, in the market, while the middle class people, work in the firm, and always worried to get fired by the company. The fastest way to wealth is to work for yourself and determine the size of your paycheck. Still not convinced, it's better to have $10 million in the bank that earned from business than $10,000 that earned from a job, and some debts. The world-class people provide great value to the market, so they earn a lot in a year than people who work in a job earns in a lifetime. 32. Middle class believes in financial scarcity. The world-class believes in financial abundance. Money doesn't grow on trees, the sentence most of the time parents told us. This sentence makes us believe money is hard to earn, this one sentence changed our mindset a lot, it's developed a limited mentality in us. But the world-class people know, money is unlimited, it's not hard to earn, it is an exchange tool, we can earn a large sum of money if we provide, value to the market. In reality, money grows in trees, in the real world, trees are creative ideas and solutions to problems. In this world, there is a lot of problems that need to solve, the more problems you can solve, the more money you can make from that solution, the more ideas you make, the more money you can make from ideas. World-class thinking is the most valuable skill you can acquire. Middle-class people are scared to run out of money, in their financial life. Middle-class people make decisions, based on fear, so they want, security, comfort, safety more than anything else. The masses think getting rich is primarily external, 
while the world class knows it's an inside game. Only a few people get rich, who have a fear-based mindset, but they unusually enjoy their life because they are afraid to lose all they have. 33. Middle class sees money as a weapon. The world class sees money as a tool. Another middle class people believe his money will control or manipulate people, money is a weapon, for them. Money can be abused, but that has more to do with the abuser than money itself, money isn't positive or negative it's a neutral thing. It can hurt people but it also can save people, a right person who has more money, use it wisely, make positive impacts on people's lives, he knows money is just a tool, it can save or kill people, rich will get freedom with money, he creates options with money, the rich know they can create more opportunities with money, they know there are endless possible ways to earn money. While middle class people believe money is negative, they have negative perceptions towards money, it's the reason why they don't have much. The masses believe you have to be talented or lucky to make it big, but the truth is, anyone with the courage can try, and the belief that it is possible. Understand money is just a tool, which can save or hurt people, but it depends on the person who has it. But the middle class only think money is a weapon, they even don't think that weapon will save them, they only think money will hurt people. 34. Middle class believes they aren't worthy of great wealth. World class believes they deserve to be rich. The middle class people always believe they don't deserve wealth, the middle class has a belief they don't have the right to be rich, they don't hope to get rich, and they don't even ask for wealth. The middle class don't wish or pray to become rich, they think don't have enough skills to talents to become rich. The poor always think they're unworthy to ask for large wealth, you don't get what you don't wish. But the world class convince themselves, they have the right to become rich, they feel they're deserved to get rich, the world class has the hope to become rich, they wish to become rich. This is why some of the smartest people are among the poorest, while people of average intelligence build fortunes through their beliefs, positive expectations, and focus. Whether you can or you can't you're right, the same way, whether you think you have or you don't have the right to become rich, you're right. It's all in your hands to ask for what you want if you can become rich, then why you do ask for less, everyone in this world has the right to become rich, one can stop you then your mindset, change your mindset too, you're worth to become rich, you're valuable, you already have enough skills and talents to become rich. If you can choose to be rich, why would you settle for mediocrity? 35. Middle class denies the importance of money. World class knows money is a critical component of life. The middle class people deny the importance of money and wealth in real life, they think being poor is pride, they don't accept or understand the power of money in reality. The middle class people don't have the interest to talk about money, they believe money will make them materialistic, and they think having more money is morally wrong, while they are afraid of fear and terror that comes from being broke. Meanwhile the world class knowledge, the importance of money in real life, they know being poor not pride it's a shame, they know being rich is actual pride, they accept and understood the power of money in society, they interested to talk about money, in public or family, the world class money will only make them more of what they already are, they know having more money gives them more option, they know they will get freedom by having money, money will not make them happy, but it will not give fear for paying bills on time. The rich focus on increasing net worth rather than increasing debts, the rich focus on opportunities more than obstacles. While the same middle class people advise, money won't make you happy, more money is the root of all problems. In reality, money makes you more comfortable, opens doors and creates opportunities. You can even become rich if you just redirect your time worrying about money to how to make more, the rich practices daily too, redirect their mental energy to become rich, instead of having not enough. 36. Middle class believes money is their enemy. World class believes money is their friend. We are taught that money is scarce, hard to earn and harder to keep. We were taught since childhood by parents, teachers coaches, neighbors who have little money in their pockets, teach us money is evil, it is negative, it is a very bad thing. Money is their enemy. The world class has also were taught by the same, but they escaped from their mindset, they slowly changed their think about money and wealth, their belief changed from poor to rich. They understand money is not there as a good friend, who can gives us freedom, comfortable, and teach us a lot of life lessons, and lessen our worries and increase happiness. The rich understand, they learn that money is not materialistic, people are materialistic. Money is just a medium of exchange without attachment to anything good or bad. It's like, blaming food for getting fat. The rich see money as a good friend, that can help you in any situation than any other friend can, this type of mindset lead them to have a stronger relationship with money. The great ones continue to cultivate and nurture their relationship with money by thinking about how to earn more, invest wiser, and leverage as much as possible. Remember money is a good friend who can help you anytime. 37. 
Middle class waits for their ship to come in. World class builds their ship. The middle class people wait for someone or some outside force will help them to get rich in financial life. They patiently wait not for results, but to even take action. The poor wait for their leaders, governments, their favorite sportsmen to change their lives. But none of them will come and help you, it's in your hand. They don't take responsibility for their lives, they don't depend on themselves. Champions don't wait for things to happen, they make things happen. But on another side, the world class knows no one is coming to their rescue, and if their life is going to be uncommon in any way, it will be through their arts. The poor need outside energy to force them to get rich. While the rich are create inner energy that forces them to get rich in life. The ultra successful love nothing more than to see a mirror image of their struggling selves back in the days before they were rich. The biggest difference between the middle class people and world class people is, the world class people don't wait for someone help to them. They go to work for money, and to change their financial life, and the middle class still wait for someone or some things to get out of their situation. They wait for support or help to enter. 38. Middle class believes financial markets are driven by logic and strategy. World class believes financial markets are driven by emotion and greed. Money is a medium of exchange, the middle class people think, it's trading based on logic, while it's the world class people think, it's trading based on emotions. 39. Middle class believes money is about status. World class believes money is about freedom. The middle class has a mindset, everyone wants money because they to show off to people, it's status based, but the world class people know, they want money, not because they want status, but because they want freedom. 40. Middle class lives beyond their means. World class lives below their means. The middle class people live beyond their means, they get debts, they don't save money, and they don't invest money. While the world class people live below their means, they don't get into debt traps, they save money, and they invest that money.